change the highlights to negative 49. The shadows to 53. And the whites to negative 44. Then the blacks to negative 53. Go to curves and adjust like this. Saturation of red to 71. The luminance to 41. Then you go to orange and change the hue to negative 2. Saturation to 100. And the luminance to 40. Go to yellow. And adjust the hue to negative 100, and saturation to 100, and the luminance to 0. Go to green, and change the hue to negative 100, and saturation to 31. And the luminance to 50. Go to Aqua and change the hue to 16, saturation to 74, and the luminance to 0. Go to Blue and change the hue to negative 4, the saturation to negative 56. To zero. Go to purple and change the saturation to 42 and the luminance to 56. 66 on me. Then go to magenta, change the saturation to 61. Click done and go to the effects panel. Change the texture to 10, the clarity to 38, then the dehaze to 10, the vignette to negative 31. Then the midpoint to 43. Then change the feather to 67. And the roundness to 34. Do not change anything here in the details. And there you have it. This is now the best tone preset in Adobe Lightroom that I created. Let's see the before. This is the before. This is now. So let's copy this one. Paste it here. And as you can see, the colors have changed. It looks smoothy. This one too. 
Use this piece of an any picture that you want to. Hold it. And there you have it. But then again, in capital letters, it is not applicable in various photos of like that. So in capital letters. Try another or create your own. In capital And beautiful girl. Go, oh baby, the last one for today. That's all for today guys. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.